Hello once again viewers, and we are now back with some more amnesia. <sighs> Alright. When we left off, we were in the machine room, we were trying to figure out this puzzle because, you know, these are levers. Levers. Oh, look at that, I can move the levers. Hmm. Okay, so let me get this straight. Maybe there's a note. Oh boy, I don't like that noise. Um, how do we get to notes? Caps lock? Escape? Nope. Uh, it's not tab, is it? I'll look. I'll use it. Adjust the levers and pressure inside the meter street up eight and down it. Okay. Well, based off of that. So let me get this straight. Okay, we have that looks like two, two, five, uh, I think that's six, five, and one. And that's okay, let's think about this. Okay, right now this is eight. So if I bring this down, it's these three and right here are eight. That's two. That's one. And if this works, this should be. Yeah, this should work. It's two, one, plus the five down here. It's gonna be eight. This is totally gonna work. The flow's even and stable. I knew it! I'm starting to think I just woke up the amnesia monster from his sleep. Because he probably doesn't like machine noise. Keep talking. The more you talk, the less scared you are. Which is always true. Can I rotate this? No. Can I rotate this? No. Oh, I didn't see this. Did I not go in storage? Am I gonna have to go back there? Alright, what is this? 14th of July, 1839. I've read every book I can find on the subject. While rich in legend and hearsay, my knowledge is lack for the insight I crave. I've sent letters to many in Herbert's address book and received answers of varying importance. <coughs> Today, I got one which differed greatly from the others from a baron in Prussia. He said nothing about the quaint stories of priests in underground temples. He didn't even mention them. He simply wrote, I know. I can protect you. Come to Brennenburg Castle. Signed, Alexander. What am I to make of this? Protect me from what? Is someone after me? I looked up Brennenburg and traced it to the Prussian woods near the Baltic Sea. While being the least informative letter I've received, it causes me greatest distress and interest. As I write, my thoughts are drawn to my nightmares in which a most disturbing sound calls to me. 
a sound defying description. A voice from the void. The last few weeks have been awful, with so many sleepless nights dreading a repeat of those horrid dreams. Tomorrow, I shall visit my physician, Dr. Tate, in hope that he can provide me with sedatives to help me sleep. Alright, well, now I don't know what to do. Should I go back to storage? Yeah, why not? I don't want to progress any further anyway. This room's scaring the crap out of me. Oh god. These noises are freaking me out. Get me out of here.
hear his theme song anymore.